Not only is Moff's snap system a fashion statement with its vegan leather wrapped accessories, it's also fully modular, so you can add and remove what you need when you need it, which is perfect for every situation, whether you're looking to slim down or make sure you're juiced up for the day. You can instantly go from this to this, because just like that, well bam and go full birthday suit or slim down and never forget your wallet as i know you'd never leave anywhere without your phone too however it's not just a system on the go because when you're at home your desk or in the office it doubles as a phone stand that's sturdy enough to take calls or just scroll through as well all that thanks to well magnets which they didn't skimp on here either with this whole pancake stack passing my scientific shake test but then when you want to easy peasy lemon squeezy the star of the whole show goes back to the snap battery pack though possibly the only fully vegan leather wrapped battery pack on the market combine that with the metallic accents not only does it look the best it honestly feels like the softest and most comfortable piece of tech i'd carry on a daily basis which i didn't think i'd ever be saying about a battery moft also considered the small details like moving the usb c port to the side so it can still be charged while set down. Combined with the included magnetic breakaway cable, it's basically like having a MacBook MagSafe charger for your iPhone. Plus, you can also use it at home, doubling as a regular wireless charger that works perfectly for your AirPods too. But the best part, once an iPhone is smacked on, you simply yank the cable away and you're good to go. Great, because the battery is so thin, it doesn't get in the way, but also portable enough, it'll slide into any pocket without weighing you down. This is probably the best looking battery and stand and combo you'll find as they have matching leather colors available too but they've also got new cases and lanyard accessories releasing soon to make a complete mobile ecosystem so you can add as you need and build the perfect mobile setup for you links and details down below i recently found this blade again and remembered exactly why i bought it not only is the spiderco dog tag the actual size of a dog tag it's really useful as a tool too mainly thanks to this beauty of a blade made of CTS BD1 steel at about an inch long and three millimeters thick. Like they say, it's not the size that matters, it's how you use it. And oh boy, will you use this on the daily. Not only because it's sharp AF, but ergonomically, for such a tiny size, it's pretty comfortable to hold too. Great to tackle any Amazon package or even some arts and crafts. Utilizing a slip joint, so while it does take some getting used to, it's easily manageable one-handed when combined with the giant Spyderco trademarked round hole. You can toss these onto your keychain and it'll blend right in, or better yet, utilize the lanyard hole and wear it like an actual dog tag so you've got a tool instantly accessible at all times. I can't be the only one that does this, as when I travel, I switch wallets because there are too many documents and cards to have to carry with you. And being in a different country, I want to make sure I don't lose any of them either. While Bellroy has dedicated travel wallets, I'm I'm a big fan of their folio mini wallet simply because it's secure like a travel wallet without actually looking like you're a complete tourist however it's pretty nifty on the inside as well once popped open you've got your standard card slots on both sides easily fitting up the four cards comfortably in each and even your daily essentials but it's this center compartment that honestly is just fun to play with thanks to the magnetic closure it can store coins keys and other small goods inside without having to worry about them sliding out or getting lost within your wallet while still being super easy to pinch open and just grab what you need on the fly personally i also like to dedicate the other side to different currencies which then means i've got every Everything I need to ensure that I can afford a coffee no matter where I am in the world. Now it definitely isn't the cheapest travel wallet, but you get what you pay for in quality as well. Something Bellroy is known for, whether it be their eco tan leather, very secure zip closure, or just the clean craftsmanship around the whole wallet. Add to that the fact it doesn't completely flop open, instead opening like a folder is major key so prying eyes around you don't get any funny ideas. The best part for me though, it's small and durable enough that if you wanted this to be your daily wallet at home, it totally could pass as one especially considering even with a full-on zipper it fits into your front pocket without looking like you're always happy to see me this is one of those luxury gifts that not only look good but are actually useful and you don't have to sell an organ to afford it from home in Hadfield, this is their single watch display case. And honestly, just unboxing it is a whole bonus experience in itself. I've got the single model here that comes in under $50 for the minimal watch collectors, but they do also offer larger models at a few extra dollars for the dads with four wrists to fill. But for the most part, 
The cases are designed the same. A top shelf with pegs to slide your watches onto, a bottom drawer to store your daily essentials, and a clear lid to keep your fancy bling dust free, but also protected from any spills or kids who like to touch everything shiny. When you are ready to go though, no mechanical doors or switches to break on you, simply lift and wha bam. At first, I was also skeptical. Why not just toss your watch onto your nightstand like the rest of us? But then I saw it in the right light. There's something about having it displayed like a museum piece. Basically, if Apple made a watch display, this would be it. The base consists of a pull-out drawer with the single model offering enough space for smaller accessories that you may want to grab on the way out, while the larger four-piece model can go one step further and accessorize with some added leather pads for that extra protection, but also who doesn't love a walnut and leather combo? Come on. Sliding everything in place and storing your daily essentials is a breeze in this one with the additional compartments inside. A true necessity for my fellow EDC hoarders out there, this is one of those gifts that any dad could use. When James Bond isn't in the Arctic, on some boat, or betting on red at the blackjack table, he's somewhere hot and sunny so a nice pair of shades is a must. These are the Remix Folding Sunglasses from Foldies, which if you haven't guessed, actually fold away into this, making them half the length of regular glasses and way more pocket friendly in the process. Thankfully, the lenses themselves hold their own with a seven layer lens system. They're polarized and scratch resistant as well. Perfect because you know Mr. Bond is constantly dropping these every time he hops from roof to roof. Setup is simple as there's no other way to open them, but even with all the extra hinges, they've made them withstand quite a bit of tension that it has no problem sliding comfortably onto my huge head as well. The included leather carrying case offers a velvety lining, magnetically shuts, and at about the size of a box of cigarettes, you can toss these into any pocket, console, or bag for instant access. Now to top it all off, literally speaking, there's the Stetson Bozeman hat, probably my new favorite hat of all time. With over 150 years of experience, Stetson knows a thing or two about hats. I mean, come on, this makes even my large forehead look phenomenal. That's all thanks to the 100% wool felt design that's breathable, moisture wicking, and quick drying as well, with a sweat rim on the inside that's lightly padded, making it feel like you're wearing a regular baseball cap. However, the best part is this, not having to treat it like a precious, beautiful piece of jewelry. Instead, you can actually use it, tossing it, beating it up when you're out and about, or just stuffing it into your bag, because when you take it out, well bam The wool construction holds its shape no matter how rough you are with it, and now you'll always have the perfect hat for the great outdoors, which makes it ideal to store my go-to tools, like the Craig Hill Rook Blade. Not only is this a looker, it's sharp and comfortable in the hand, even for its smaller size. Plus, they still manage to elegantly fit in a flipper mechanism, which I will tell you now is super addictive. You're getting S35VN steel in a 2.3 inch blade paired with a tiny amount of texture along the top. But otherwise, they stripped everything down to the bare essentials, and I love it. Especially in use, the all metal design helps cut through any box I throw at it, like butter, and with the drop point blade helping with more precise cuts when needed as well. Once done, unlocking the large frame lock is simple enough to do single handed and packed away, the rounded design with chamfered edges makes it one of the coolest looking yet safest knives to carry with you. Time. For anyone that's ever wanted to solve a Rubik's Cube on their own and can just throw money at something to figure it out, there's the Go Cube, basically a smart Rubik's Cube, mainly because you connect it to your phone and access a wide range of games, challenges, and of course, a built-in solver, taking you step by step, tracking your every move until wabam. Now you know, money can buy you happiness. The companion app is a must as it tracks your stats as you progress, basically like a workout tracker, but for your fingers and your mind. The coolest part though, is it also tracks the cube's movement in real time. So no matter how bad you mess up, it'll always know how to take you home one spin at a time. However, with patience and a few YouTube videos, you could probably learn how to solve it on your own. What makes the Go Cube stand out and actually useful is once you take the time to go through their learning academy, they offer a range of other fun features like being able to challenge others around the world to test your big brain energy. But if you can't afford Wi-Fi, they also have a range of offline games like playing a piano with a Rubik's Cube. 
The cube itself is comfortable thanks to the rounded edges and corners, not your official tournament style design, but definitely more approachable for beginners. It also feels fairly sturdy, with each spin snapping into place perfectly and every square staying snug in its frame, so it can easily handle your failure and rage quitting. The battery life is rated for 60 hours, but the included charger comes with a cool stand that you just simply pop it into, making it easy to pull out and show off how much money you spent to finally say you can solve a Rubik's Cube. If your dad loves a couch as much as he loves you, then he definitely needs this couch console all-in-one device storage solution. Because unlike others that just keep things tidy, this one has a self-balancing cup holder for the clumsiest of dads and the messiest of kids. Simply pack it up with your favorite drink and snacks, set it down on any soft surface at an arm's length away, and now you never go hungry or thirsty ever again while raging at 12-year-olds on Call of Duty. The best part about it though is its modular design, as each compartment can be tetris around, and the divider also doubles as a container lid too. The opposite side is one large space to keep TV controllers from playing hide-and-seek, but it also has a large storage space within it to have all your other vibrating devices nearby and hidden away. When filled up, you can even plug in an external battery that's accessible through the outside USB-C to keep your phone or tablet charged without being restricted to a wall charger. But in the end, it's the fact that although this provides you with cup holders and trays, it's designed to be used and stored in any way you personally like. More stacks, less chips, double fisting drinks, and even adding an armrest when you flip over the top lid. Honestly, what can't this do? For a size comparison, I was able to empty out a whole bag of Oreos and toss in plenty extra bags of snacks as well. More than enough space for movie night, plus it's also 100% dishwasher safe too. So let me know in the comments what snack you'd fill this up with. For me, definitely glossettes. Now inside the actual pocket, this side is also reserved for the wallet of choice. Lately, going to the form function form architect wallet, as it doubles as a notebook holder too, killing two stones with one bird or however that saying goes. At the core of it though, it's a very minimal leather card sleeve. They offer several colorways, but I've got the Chrome XL leather in a black, but you can see the natural grain on the inside as well, since what you're really paying for is the quality in material and craft with the saddle stitch finish. This is one of those things that will only get better with use. Now the centerpiece does go to the standard Moleskine Volant notebooks, a credit card sized notebook with tearaway pages and a stiff cover. When slotted in, it fits perfectly almost like it was designed for it. But behind that now is enough space to store up to three cards, but generally I rock four in the daily, although I will warn you that the leather will expand to the larger size and there's no going back from that. Plus it's nothing fancy. There's no clips or locks to keep things in, but it still does a decent job at holding things in place through my scientific shake test. Now to actually use the notebook, we've got to have a pen, and my new favorite has to go to the tactile turn mini side click. They offer a few different metals, but I've got the zirconium, which will definitely make your bank account cry, but it's one of those purchases that you buy once and never have to think about any other pens ever again. It uses standard pilot refills, which are smooth and write beautifully, but honestly, you just carry it with you because it's such a beautiful piece of machinery and that wicked click action is a classic fidget toy we all love to hate but still can't stop playing with. They also release seasonal designs too like their Nautilus which I've gotten the short length. It's slightly longer than the mini but just as wicked especially with the added details. I know you never thought you'd be spending this much on a pen until now. So with something so beautiful having a wallet that keeps it with me is a win-win. Even if you don't cop the pen I always recommend having a physical notebook with you just in case that next billion dollar napkin idea comes to mind. But personally I'm also just a sucker for multi-use products too.